Hi guys. So today's video is just going to be kind of a heads up and a little bit of an outline for next month's buddy read. In July, the buddy read has been the Poppy War and it's been so, so fun getting to buddy read it with a bunch of different groups. But for those of you who didn't do the July buddy read, I wanna give a heads up as to how the August buddy read is going to work. First, I'll let you know what the book is going to be. And so for August, the buddy read is going to be on A Shadow of What Was Lost by James Islington. The reason I went with this book is because I wanted to pick a book that I haven't seen a ton of people talk about. Well, I definitely think it's super fun to be swept away on the hype train and get on board all these bandwagons for these popular books and series. I also think it's fun to discover new, really amazing little hidden gems. And I also think it's really fun to discover these little hidden gems with other people. In this case, I went with A Shadow of What Was Lost, which isn't exactly a little gem. If it turns out being great, it will be a giant gem. But the reason that I went with this one is for actually a few reasons. One is I've had a few people tell me that this book is really, really amazing and I need to check it out. And then also my friend Murphy over at Murphy Napier, she is interested in reading this. I think big giant books like this that are in the epic fantasy category can be very intimidating and they can be a little bit scary to get into on your own. But if you're reading it in a group setting, I think it makes it so much easier to digest it. It makes it so much easier to take it all in. All that said, the premise of the book actually sounds really phenomenal as well. The world is this place where 20 years ago, these godlike beings were defeated and taken out and overthrown. And anybody who served these people were known as gifted. And one of our main characters named Davian is a gifted and he's very much looked down upon. And he's kind of having to deal with the consequences of a lost war that he wasn't even a part of. However, Davian discovers that he may have some of the powers that the godlike beings that were defeated had. And going alongside that, there's also another perspective of a person person who wakes up in the middle of the forest covered in blood, no idea who they are or how they ended up that way. There's also possibly this ancient evil beginning to stir. I definitely think it sounds really, really fantastic. And I thought a lot of you would think it sounds really, really intriguing as well. If you do think it sounds really great and you do want to participate in the buddy read, I purposefully am going to be uploading this early enough in July so that you have time to either go to your local library like I did to pick up a copy or you can purchase yourself a copy. And if you weren't a part of the buddy read last month and are new to this and have no idea how it works, all you'll have to do is leave a little bit of information in the comment section down below. First, you'll tell me your preferred means of buddy reading. You have two options. You can either say you want to buddy read this on Instagram or on Voxer. Also leave your handle so I can actually find you. If you are indifferent as to whether you want to read on Instagram or Voxer, feel free to leave your handles for both of them. From there, it's not required, but I also very much appreciate if you tell me what your time zone is so that I can try to group you with other people in like time zones. Anyway, as far as the groups go, I will be putting people in groups of anywhere between five and 10 or 12 people. And the reason for this is because it's just so much easier to feel like you're connecting with other people and that you're actually able to communicate your thoughts when the groups aren't absolutely enormous. I am also going to have a Goodreads group this time around so that way if you want to connect with people on a broader spectrum and you want to get to chat with people from other groups, the Goodreads is going to be an option. In case you're forgetting any of this information, I will have it all linked down below in the description bar as well as the link to the Goodreads group. And I'm also going to have a projected reading schedule. The buddy read is going to be for the entire month of August. So you don't have to rush through it. You don't have to try to finish it within one week because heck, this is a pretty fat book, but you by no means have to stick to the schedule. It's just that way at the end of every week, we know at what point not to spoil people past. At the end of the month, I will put up a spoiler chat video so that we can all get our thoughts out in one place. And I will likely also have a non-spoiler book review that way for people who aren't a part of the buddy read but are interested in knowing general thoughts about the book, they'll have that option to view as well. That's it though. I am super, super excited for this next month's buddy read. Like I said, I wanted to give you all enough time to get your hands on this book if you are interested in participating. That's it though. I am so, so excited for this buddy read. Thanks so much for watching though. I hope you all have a great rest of your day and happy reading. Bye guys.